Time for the most biased sports report. Quebec Premier Jean Charest is uh, still on this NHL story saying that Gary Bettman is, quote, keen on bringing a team back to Quebec City. The Premier said, and I quote, a tout à l'évêque le nordique, n'est-ce pas? Wow, sounds, uh, sounds promising. Bengals receiver Chad Uchosenko, formerly Chad Johnson, wants to change his name again, this time to Hatchy Go. Chad Hatchy Go. Because Hatchy Go is Japanese for 8 5. He uh, made the announcement on his Ustream webcast, then he held up a jersey that said Hatchy Go on it. Can't this guy just catch footballs? <laughs> Isn't that his job? That's what you do, okay? Sombrero. Uh, what else has he done? The snow pile, all that stuff, it's, it, you don't do that. I mean, it's funny, but still. Ucho Cinco is better than Hatchy Go. The agent for Barry Bonds announced yesterday that Bonds is done playing baseball. Right on. And it's, uh, it's not 2007. I thought he was done two years ago. Because nobody wants him. His agent said, quote, when 2008 came around, I couldn't get him a job. When 2009 came around, I couldn't get him a job. Now 2010, I'd say it's nearly impossible. It's unfortunate to have an ending to a storied career like that. No, it's, it's the steroids that were the unfortunate end to the storied career. It was a steroid storied career, and then I'm glad it's over. Now he's no longer the home run king. He's just the burger king. NASCAR hottie Danica Patrick... And now she is releasing her own perfume. It's called Danica Patrick for her. And if she's on the bottle, I'm pretty sure most guys will buy it for the wife. Those GoDaddy commercials are phenomenal. I still don't know what GoDaddy does, but I like the commercials. Mistress number two. You know I was going to talk about Tiger. Mistress number two, the one that left Tiger the voicemail. Or the one that Tiger left the voicemail with, I should say. Hey, it's, uh, it's Tiger. She says that uh, he never mentioned he was married. Oops. Uh-oh. He never mentioned it. So it's his fault. And this is the one that, uh, what was it, two years he had the relationship with? I mean, how could she have known? He didn't tell her. How was she supposed to know he was married? All that time, she didn't know. It's, I mean, he's Tiger Woods. Your grandma knows he's married. It's, he's not Joey Buttafuoco. <laughs> He's Tiger Woods. And even if you don't know, he's married. I mean, who's that blonde that was following him around all that time? You know, the one on TV that he kisses after he wins the U.S. Open, the same one that was at Augusta clapping when he made the putts. What did you think? Wow, she's around him a lot. I wonder who she is. Must be his sister. Might be a cousin or a friend. Unbelievable. Let's give her one of these. That's all I got.